Welcome back, everybody. So yeah, last episode. <laughs> Sorry if I got a bit cranky there. I was actually last time I played, I played maybe four hours total that day, so I was pretty tired and <laughs> that stupid mistake. I always make stupid mistakes when I'm tired and then I get even more pissed off and then I make even more stupid mistakes. But now, now I feel a lot better and hopefully I don't make stupid mistakes <laughs> like walk into my own mind or, or grenades. Uh, I wish those were slightly bigger on the screen. So you could see them more easily. But I still wonder... What, I think they might have slightly over nerfed the, or buffed the sanity loss in the latest patch. Because there is absolutely no reason for those guys to panic when you are the one doing the killing the last guy. But anyway, I digress. Uh, all right, but I was doing some blood plasma. So let's do some healing gel, I guess. And I'm not sure. Uh, Monsters. Okay, I'll slow. Well, if that's Dagon with the deep ones, then I really need to <laughs> get rid of Dagon. And everybody's wounded. Yeah, I wonder if the bio exosuit is better or hazmat suit against those. That type of damage. And I think I said one episode, I think laser damage is different than electrical damage because I was checking out the, some of the armors there. So I think laser damage is its own own thing. Like this says something said about laser damage. May I don't know, maybe. Or maybe I was wrong. Or does the hybrid purge as well? I can do the hybrid purge with this team, I think. And do you have any UAC rifles? No. Well, you have a rocket launcher. And yeah, I need to get the plasma grenade. Uh, but I wonder how I do that. I have some plasma grenades here. Uh, plasma grenade. Uh, oh, I need Illyrium. Well, I, I want that. Because the high explosive is it's just too heavy. It is just too heavy. And I have absolutely no no guys here to do that mission here, terrorize. So what about my this team here? Uh, I said I have some decent guys here, I guess. Like Duke Duke is always good. A splinter. Do you have any? You have a UAC rocket launcher. I could use that. Uh, get rid of the anti-personal mine. Oh, I'm missing proxy proxy grenades. I need to ship some proxy grenades there. So I'll do this this first, this hybrid purge.
I don't think I've done one of those yet. Maybe, I, I don't know. I, I, I don't think I've done those. I've done the farm. Uh, proxy grenades, okay. Burn it to the ground. All right. Uh, okay, these guys. I don't have enough guns here. Well, that, that means you can... You can grab that. And a grenade and healing. You get a rifle. And you get extra ammo, I guess. Change, don't start with a grenade. Uh, pick up a magnum as well, it's too heavy. Nobody. Well, this is a... What was hybrid purge? Where is everybody? But there's nowhere to hide. Oh, nice. There really isn't anywhere to hide here for me. Oh, there's a guy right there. Oh crap. Well, I guess I have to do this the old fashioned way. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Oh no. Where's my... Where's my this guy here for next turn? Can you please hit this thing? 106%, so he should hit this. Those things need to die instantly. And you... Can't hit that. I wonder what the range is on these pistols. So if I just stay out of range. Good shot. Good shot. It's bleeding. Well, okay, hide here. Hmm. Oh, well, what to do here now? Not a bad shot. 
but uh, no damage. Uh, all right, everybody back to the ship. Uh, here. There he is. And there's a thing. Uh, you do not fire. Okay, uh, I wish there was some I mean, I could run here, but the, the flying disc just flies. It's like in the original game when you got the flying flying suit. You would just fly to the highest level and then you would just shoot everything. Or just go to a corner and destroy everything with a plaster launcher. Uh, with the flying suit you could easily throw grenades everywhere or anywhere you wanted. There it is. There it is. So you see it from here. So this square, two squares from the tire. That's 41. That's not enough, so you have to actually Why would you do that, you damn idiot? I just said don't fuck up and I have to fuck up that would have been a great shot but this stupid brain of mine it doesn't work Well, that's a tough guy. Oh, here's one. I think that's a, a GBU or something. No, I need to save the rocket. I could shoot the guy, but... I need to save the rocket for the flying disc. Okay, shoot this guy. What? Ah, oh, you're fine. You're fine. Because the disc is... I'm really scared about the disc. Laser disc. Why did you use... Re I wish you could turn off the reaction fire. I wish there was a button you could turn off the reaction. That they... they I mean, I could give a guy an order. Do not use reaction ever until I... Tell otherwise. That would be so great. I, that would have saved... <laughs> So many unnecessary kills or deaths of my agents and a lot less swearing and losing my temper and losing my mind and my sanity. Yeah, my, my sanity bar would be around here. 
in real life. You are there. Okay, unlucky Luke. You are not so unlucky this time. James, shoot him. There is the disc. So you should hit this. Yeah, luckily a large rocket takes down those. So good to know. And if I have a guy with over 90 accuracy, I can just use aim shot. Somebody's in a building. Probably here. You're up. But yeah, <laughs> I really start. I really need to start playing better and not make stupid mistakes like forget to expend the time units and because that just. Okay, there's one. No line of fire. Oh, he has an Uzi. But you're blocking the way now. No, it's Mac 10. Well, that's even worse than, I mean. I guess in this game, I don't know which one is better, Uzi or Mac 10, but both kind of crap. Oh, there's one. Well... There's no better thrill than overkill. Oh god damn it. <laughs> if you wanna kill somebody, why not overkill them? Come on with this bit. Now he's gonna shoot me with a chem pistol. No, he's just... Okay, that's a stair. Oh. Ah, uh, sure, whatever. You're not gonna hit anything with that. I mean... You did hit Luke, I guess. <laughs> but no worries. James is good. And that's the last guy. No. Uh, I really thought that was the last guy. Unlucky looking actually stay here and try not to die. Okay, good shot. Oh, that was the second one. And you have no. Who is here? Uh, okay, I'll give you a chance. Do something spectacular. Okay, out of range. Never mind. Um, 
There you are. You can just take a random shot there. Oh crap, there's two discs. Abort. Abort mission. Why are there two discs? Again, this this is one of the bullshit things the computer does. It doesn't move its units. It stops moving its units. So how the hell am I supposed to know there's two discs there? Do not reserve for anything. You're probably dead. I'm lucky Luke you need to run out. And Boris, you go here. There's a disc. Do I have Okay you Better not miss. Uh, you can shoot it, but oh, you, it actually did something. So that's a big hit and a small hit. Zero. And <laughs> forty percent chance. Well, no damage. You're shooting through the window. And there was another one there. No damage. No damage. Well, you're up. Get this thing. Oh, and there was also a hybrid. But if anyone else is playing this game, can. Can, or am I imagining it? I mean, the computer just stops moving its units. It just stands there doing nothing. And instantly you get the next turn. And there were oh, three enemies left. And it did nothing. So, that is... Just bull bullshit. Okay, that, good. That's maybe five hits. Okay, good. Man. Uh, sell that. I don't think I need armor piercing shells. Oh, 
or chem pistols. Okay, good. That went pretty well, actually. What is the cult base? What was this? Cult outpost. Oh, the monsters are gone. God damn. That's gonna cost me a lot of points. That's 600 points. Shit. Oh, post, well... Can you even get there? No. No, you cannot. Oh, heavy tactical suit. Uh, heavy armor provides maximum protection available or technology. So, quite a bit more armor and less damage taken from kinetic and incendiary. What about laser? Chemical, 80%. Warp, what the hell is a warp weapon? Time units minus 12. Time. So you, I would lose seven time units. And a lot more stamina and reactions. And it is strong, it is very, very strong. If I could carry this heavy tactical suit with this shield, then that would be tough. I would just have a walking tank. I'm, I'm not sure if I'm going to use this, although... It is good. Okay. Uh, what the hell is this? Mm. The alien alloys. I need to get rid of these damn agents and supervisors and ghoul and streaks so I can get some new stuff. Bacon morph corpse. Get the get these chemical weapons also, so I can see what they are. Heavy tactical suit. Oh, I can make the bulletproof coat. Oh, I got the. Oh, now I got. So, is this something I can use in an undercover mission? If so, then this is a lot better. <laughs> this is a, almost something I could use all the time. I mean... It's pretty much on par with the Kevlar base because you take less kinetic damage, you have a bit less armor but you take less damage also and you take a lot less incendiary damage and la laser damage and cutting damage so maybe I need to okay you get plus five reactions as well sophisticated electronics grant the wear improved night vision 
So this might be something I could use against the zombies in the zombie hive. But yeah, I'll be definitely making some of those so I don't have to use... It's a lot better than a leather jacket. Yeah, that, I'll be making those. Um, I'll get the, not this base, this base, equip craft, um, you, okay. uh, let me just check how oh, you can get that, okay. Everybody's training. Oh, I need to... Okay, I, I shouldn't train you because... I need to send you on a mission. But yeah, I, I lost a 600 points in it. Get a UAC rocket launcher as well, and I I I'd use those shrapnel rockets, but I prefer this. Uh, large rockets, so I can destroy buildings and stuff. So yeah, let's send this. So if I can if I can shoot that down. Mm. Uh, I think this one black. I think black lotus is the only one left. Because exalt is dead. Dagon is. I mean, it could be a Dagon. Is this a Dagon mission? So if that's the case, I Arasakas are fine. And you can use that. Grab some more grenades. It is a Dagon mission. You have a pistol, not to worry about now you have sort of you have a G11. guy I wish I had better guys here I wish I had better guys Get him. Uh, 
And get him. No. Get him. Second row. Shoot over their head. That guy's tough. You gotta not do not shoot. Especially this do not fire that thing. Okay, James, take him out. Okay, you can take him out. Oh, maybe you can. Shit. You have a pistol, you have a <laughs> Oh and a grenade launcher. Well you could actually just shoot him. I mean you could but you didn't. That is way too many enemies. Screw you. I killed four. I don't. I don't want to deal with that crap. They're gonna scan soon anyway, so screw them. Screw those guys. Let's just use those shrapnel grenades because I have quite a few of them. You can. I'm sure you can have that. No, not that. Uh, that's too heavy. Uh, grab this. I mean, you could carry a laser pistol. I mean, you can carry a magnum. But I think you better carry that. And that. Uh, okay, you can now get a rifle, actually. And be somewhat useful. You could carry one of these. And you could carry one of these. And why is this a night mission? It, I thought this was... Oh great, fantastic. I mean, I did say I was gonna do a night mission. A chaser? The 
hell is a chaser? Well, I have a thing for chasers. Let me introduce you to it. It's called a rocket. Alright, that works. I don't know what that chaser is, but at least I'm seeing something else other than sectoid and hybrid. Yeah, but a night mission isn't optimal. I'm in a corner. So there's that. Um, but these guys can probably see in the dark, so... Do I have any flares? That's um... Seems I have forgotten to take any flares. Well, I do have something to light this place up. I don't know if those things care about fire, but you need to reload. Oh, you are too weak and slow to be useful. They should light the place up quite nicely. Mm. Looks like a, a robot. So, Jesus, do not shoot Kronos, you. Kronos. He's on fire. Why is this a damn night mission? You shouldn't die. Screw this. And your night mission. What the? Why is this? This shouldn't be a night mission. What the hell is this? Giant spy. Well, I can do giant spiders.
What the hell is a chaser and what the hell was... Why the hell was... Why was that a night mission? I... Shouldn't have been a night mission. And this place, well, you can... Whatever. I just want to shoot these things down. I don't want to do the missions. I want to shoot these down. Over the sea. Now this thing is destroyed. And so is my ship. It's probably gonna take four months to repair that, so... What the hell is a chaser? Oh, there's a... Uh, do you... Try to this. Yes. Okay, that works. So those guys are not super tough. Because so only 70 damage. So they have... Less than 70 hit points. That means... I don't have any <laughs> really good guys here. Tough against bullets. Oh, there's a guy. use these rockets then. Oh, next turn. I, I just shoot the rockets. Sure, whatever. I can do that. Since these work. Ow. Well, take this. And now... You are probably dead. Wait, they do bleed. So they are not mechanical units. They do seem quite impervious to 
bullets. Oh, oh well, I guess they do die. Can you shoot them enough? There was one guy here. You need to run here. And you can check out this corner. And nobody here. To rest one turn. Oh, actually, you're just going insane. I mean, this is kind of dumb that you cannot even take one turn to rest. So you get some energy back. They they really overtuned the, the sanity thing here with the latest patch. I need that. I might go back to one point. I don't know if I can go back to one point three because that is just crazy how fast you look I mean just a few turns and these guys are panicking so they're gonna just kill each other so that is what is that I mean what what I didn't mean to do that. Oh, that's one. With a pistol. I don't know if I can stun these guys actually. Okay. Are you are you dead? You might be dead. Well, I don't I don't agree. I just want to do this mission. And then I'll probably cut the video there. Yeah, I need to get plasma weapons, then I could no night vision because I just shoot plasma because it burns everything. Yeah, these guys have no energy and they're going insane. Okay, good shot. And now he panics. Why? Why does he panic? And this guy doesn't have... Because he's panicked, he's done... It makes no sense. It makes absolutely no sense to be panicking like that. They, they should change the coding. If there is one guy left, you, you should... If you have... 50% or more of your own guys left and there's only one enemy... There should never ever be a situation where they panic. Let's say you have a team of 16 guys and you have 8 or more guys left and there's one of them. These guys should never ever panic in that situation. Whereas the enemy should be shitting their pants but They just, whoever does the coding doesn't really have 
they can't really think about stuff like that. How how is that how does that make sense? I mean I know it's a game, but they're trying to mimic real life somewhat here. And there there are there are a lot of good things, but stuff like that. How is that, how would any team panic against one guy? If... Let's say there's you kill sixty enemies, and there's one of them left. So you're the last guy out of sixty people, and the rest of your team is dead. How the hell does that make a group of 16 guys come fly, land and take kill 60 of your friends and you're the last survivor and yet they panic? It just doesn't make any sense. So I wish they would change it, if there's a way to change it that make a if if sentence or some, some kind of stuff in the code that okay if if you your team is this and that then these guys cannot really panic unless shit happens and they catch fire or something like it, it wouldn't be that difficult to code in even though I don't really have that much of a I'm not a very good coder I know maybe a few lines but You can take a chance, but you couldn't take that chance. I need to get closer, but I don't really wanna. And now he dropped this gun again, this guy here. There's too much damn smoke here. Do not risk it. Go here, hide. Where is he? And he's dead. I mean, th this kind of fucking. Bo okay, I'm getting pissed off again. I'm getting really fucking pissed off again. Like, this stupid fucking bullshit. Like, how is this? How does this make any goddamn sense? There's one of them, probably. There he is. Yeah. Stupid goddamn bullshit like this just really ticks me off. This guy shouldn't be panicking ever. Shoot him. I lost this agent for n nothing because he panicked again. One enemy. It doesn't make any sense. I didn't even get the corpses. No, wait, I did. Okay, never mind. I was looking at the wrong. Oh, corpus 7. But I lost an agent because stupid crap like that. So either they should just tone down the sanity loss slightly or give rookies a bit more sanity or just, I don't know, to make, make I mean, that would be the best if you, if your team is alive and there's one enemy left, 
then there shouldn't be any situation really that your team is just eating shit. It just doesn't make any sense. Crap, well, I'll do the crap circles. And then I'll finish this. Oh, that's the ghoul. Uh, this type of zombie is similar to the base type, but special diet provided by Strix. Provides it with enough bioplasma to stabilize its metabolism at the cost of some body mass. Special hormones, okay. Uh, Well, it, it gave me nothing really. <laughs> get the alien alloys. Uh, get this. I don't know. Get that and that and. Tell me about the sectoid soldier. Okay, it's crop circles. I mean, could be men in black. I guess. And I need knockout grenades as well. I really, need, I really need to set up some workshop somewhere, which just pumps out knockout grenades and proximity grenades and armor and stuff like that. I gotta do that. Well, it is these guys. Alright then. Get ready to get wrecked. And well, there goes the civilian. Well, in that case... I should take, take the rocket launcher. I should just take the rocket launcher. Oh my, but yeah, that makes no sense when your team panics when there's no reason to panic. Guy's dead. Oh, I didn't get a negative score on that. Well, that's good. Black Ops Manum. 
Human farmer corpse, I don't want that. So, well, I got pissed off again, but it's just, I just don't understand why, why do you, as your team, why do these guys panic when there's no, re absolutely no reason to panic? And it could be, it could be coded easily that if, if X amount of team members are alive against X amount of, or Y amount of enemies, then uh, I don't know, sanity loss is zero or panic equals false or something. I don't know how, how to exactly do that, but just basically do that, code that. Uh, in that cave mission, on that Dimension X cave mission, I was looking for that stupid worm in that bunker hiding there, and my guys just went nuts. What was the reason of them going insane? Absolutely no reason for that. But yeah, okay. I, I think I will stop here. And um, yeah, thanks for watching and see you next time. Later.